Hello and welcome to my FireMonkey video blog. Today I want to show you how easy it is to create a thumbnail list of images with FireMonkey and Delphi. Here you see already the demo form. Here on the bottom is uh, a thumbnail list which is an image box in a frame. And here you see an image. When you click on the list box uh, then there will an image uh, display. <coughs> I just run the program and you will see it is really fast. When I click at load images it has load in the very short time more than 400 uh, images, 473, so it is really very fast. And um, it runs also on Linux and is fast and of course it runs also on Mac OS. So and now let's see how it is done. It's done with a frame and uh, we can here have a look at this unit uh, around about 100 lines. This is a list box with the list style horizontal, so the images are displayed aside. If you want to use uh, the thumbnail list uh, vertical, but, uh, for example on the left or right side on the window, you uh, change this to vertical and then it is all fine. Here in the form, in the frame, I have also um, a hidden template uh, list item, so we can make it visible for the moment. So you can see I have here um, the uh, list box and there is inserted a text for the file name and there is in inserted the image and uh, one line and another line for the right side and for the bottom. Um, I have also set um, the wrap mode to place so that the images are centered and for the text uh, it's left aligned and I have used uh, character trimming. So it is uh, more easy to make this all at design time so and I don't have to, to assign this all at runtime. And uh, I will just mention for short I have in a previous version make another solution. I um, uh, created a new style for it and use it like this. But there is a um, disadvantage when you uh, use a style for it, then you have also an extra uh, style file component on your form and that makes problem when you have another style form where you have loaded your style for the application and then uh, as a result your thumbnail list uh, will not be styled. But here with this solution then the thumbnail list is also styled like the rest of your form. When we go back to the main form and to the load images button, here is a, a function called show, a procedure called show files and folder, folders with a file name and if you want also with a special mask. So let's, look, let's have a look into the frame. So here is this show files and folders. Um, at first we have a filter predictate function which will test if the um, images, if the kind of the image, for example JPEG, PNG and so on, is supported on this platform. And um, uh, if yes then the result is true and uh, the file name will be listed here in the for file name in T-Rect directory get files. You give at first parameter the directory and a second parameter 
the filter predicate. Uh, you perhaps know that the get files um, function has several um, overload um, versions. When you look at here, you have the normal only with the past and then uh, with the search pattern, but also this one with the um, um, filter predicate. And so uh, we iterate to the existing files. We create um, the list box in the way that we clone uh, this list box item that we have uh, created in the at design time. And we set then uh, the text. And then we assign the on apply style lookup uh, this function. And in this function, we can see what will happen. Um, it checks if the sender is a list box item. And then here it uh, is looking for the images. I can't use find style resources because we haven't it included in a style um, file. So it does not work. And so we have to use this approach. And if we have found these images, we use um, the load thumbnail from file, where you give only the file name and the width and the height. Unfortunately, this works at the moment only on Windows. I don't know why it not work on Mac and Linux. I thought in the past it has worked, but I don't know why. It work doesn't work now, so I've make a little workaround. If this that no, if this not work, we use this a little function load and shrink image. Then the uh, bitmap is load loaded in the um, full size, and after that is uh, created a thumbnail from it. So that means that the um, bitmap bitmap is shrinked and it is only a small amount uh, of memory used. Yeah, so easy it is. So you can download this frame again from my dev page. When you go to the www.devpage.de, go to downloads. And here is a frame image list box. And there is a short description and um, I will add also a download link here. That's it. Have fun. Bye bye.